Yo, it's your boy DC Tree from DCTree-Nation.com where we cover hoops and heroes and today we're talking heroes. Did y'all see that new Avengers Endgame trailer, baby? Man, that thing was tough, man. And one of my favorite parts in the trailer was my boy Rocket hanging out with War Machine on the shoulder just like he was when Thor came in Wakanda ready for war. And I got several reasons why these two characters are going to show out and go crazy in Avengers Endgame. It's their time. It's their time. But before I jump into it, if you like my content, please subscribe to the channel. Okay, the first thing you got to do, you have to look at the roster left after the last movie, after the snap. And when you really look at the roster, the two people that are just tech geniuses that are still in the squad is War Machine and Rocket. Now, Rocket has that intergalactic feel. Imagine him in a room with War Machine for an extended period of time. It looks like there's going to be a bit of a gap between Affinity War and Endgame. So they got plenty of time to cook up some monster-like weaponry, monster-like bombs, explosives, you name it. And I'm pretty sure War Machine has learned a lot from Tony Stark. And even if he didn't learn a lot, Hell, Tony coming back. That's confirmed in the trailer. He's going to meet up with them again. So you're going to have Tony, Rhodey, and Rocket in the room coming up with weapons. Come on, y'all. Y'all know that's going to be huge. That's going to be huge. Another reason why they're going to be tough. They ain't facing no humans. They ain't facing nobody on Earth. They going for war. You see what I'm saying? They going for blood. They killing folks. Thanos ain't no mercy for him after what he did. He's dying. These guys are equipped with the weaponry to kill people. War machine, not battle machine, not fight machine, not knockout machine, war machine. You know what I'm saying? So they going to come hard with it, y'all. They're going to come hard with it. And man, I'm telling you, I can't wait for that scene with war machine and Iron Man back to back, just like in Iron Man 2, on, but on a larger scale. I know what's coming. I can't wait for that moment because, you know, this um, this um, Robert Downey Jr.'s last hurrah. So, you know, they're going to go hard. They know he got to have that moment with Rhodey. He got to have that moment. And then, whoo, if them boys pull out the proton cannon, I'm going to be honest with y'all. They bring out the proton cannon. I don't cry, man. I don't tear up right there in the theater on my dogs. I'm still a thug, though. I'm still a thug, though. <laughs> but they bust a proton cannon. From the Marvel vs. Capcom games in this, I'm tearing up. I am tearing up right there at that moment, man. I'm too hyped for this, man. So don't sleep on Rocket and War Machine, man. They're going to have hella good weaponry, hella good scenes, hella good one-liners. I can't wait for it. I can't wait. I'm hyped for the whole movie, man. These jokers know how to put together a trailer. I give you that. They know what they're doing, y'all. All right, guys, that's it for this one. For more information on heroes, check out the main page, dctrue-nation.com. Like us on Facebook. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Help a brother out. Peace.